What's up? So I've just finished a Zoom meeting with uh, Webster. We were just recapping uh, <laughs> March the 27th of the Bundesliga and, you know, just sharing our thoughts. And I've just realized I did not record the meeting. <laughs> ah. Like I've just realized I did not record it after to Mamaliza Kongena and you may to record any shit. And you have a, had a very interesting conversation. You've talked about uh, the comments that Nyebala can make lately, Kusu Bandai, of which we totally disagree with. And of course, uh, we feel like uh, he's just trying to fight his own era. But, you know, of course, Webby was, was of the opinion that after he came to physicality, he said, Kusu Bandai can as a match out. And as a match out, Mr. Kadrogba. Kuna Mr. Kadrogba is a physically, physicality wise, he can outdo Van Dijk by far. You know, Mr. Kadrogba, I mean, but Debay versus Van Dijk. You know, Van Dijk is fast, he's strong, so he would very much suit any era of the Premier League. He's not an all time best Premier League defender, but he's not a terrible one. And in the current era, he's one of the best, so that's what it is. We've looked at uh, the 88-89 season between Liverpool and Arsenal and uh, how the game was played in the last, how the league deciding match was the last game of the league. You know, Arsenal going away to Anfield, having to win or having to win by two goals so that they can win the, the title over Liverpool. It was a very crazy, crazy season, that one. I was, I was of the opinion that was the best ending ever, a season that has ever been, you know. I did not see that one, of course. <laughs> Uh, when you compare it to like 11 12 really Manchester United versus Manchester City, of course, you're quite normal. But here, 88 89, Nikamaya 11 12, equal Manchester, when I end up at 80 high. Sasa and your game to decide you up when you're a league, that would be something else altogether. You know what I'm saying? So, we have the opinion, of course, 88 89 was a top season. It happened May 25th. Your game will be at Sikukamaya Leo. Is it 25 or 26? Uh, I did like today, it's when the game, uh, the big deciding game happened and Arsenal won 2-0 uh, against uh, Liverpool. Now your Liverpool side is strong. Hey, likes of, uh, actually Webby is going to show the likes of uh, Ian Rush were the prime then. The, the likes of uh, John Barnes were really good, you know. So it was a strong Liverpool squad. Of course, the Arsenal side that was, now I'm going to be able to meet the back three. Of course, these things I wouldn't know, I was not even born. Uh, <laughs> Um, uh, like Arsenal, which is a back three, there was Tony Adams, Steve Bold, and um, I mean, I can't recall can the other guy, the likes of Lee Dixon and Nigel Winterburn were playing as wing backs, and of course, we had Alan Smith to come in in Rocasso in the mid. Um, yeah, it was a very interesting season that one that was crazy. It was being commemorated today on Arsenal Twitter's account. Then, of course, we have done the previews, and this is what we thought after, of course, going through the reviews. The reviews, I cannot, I cannot highlight the reviews. They, they are crazy. Uh, preview. So today we have Bayern versus, uh, Borussia versus Bayern. Typically, of course, the best home team versus the best away team going head to head. And we of the, of the opinion that Bayern was a Shindu Leo. Yeah, he thinks Borussia are more hungry, they want the title more. Of course, Bayern are going to championship DNA in Green in them. Of course, they have won the last, I don't know, eight championships. But it feels like Leo, Borussia Watabeba. Me, there is also the whole issue of the signal in Duna is not the same without the fans, right? So, of course, one big factor that can be boosting Borussia Haiko, and apart from the fact that we're going familiar territories and dressing rooms and all that, but you can't even have Bayern or Tashindai. So for me, I went for a Bayern win. <laughs> Webby was a, for a 3-2 Borussia win. Bayern Leverkusen on a chance against Bulls back. That's a win. We agreed on that. We saw Bayern and Zimbabwe Tashindai game. We don't see anything less than that. Uh, Frankfurt on a chance on a Freiburg. We touched on this one a little bit. The Frankfurt have been terrible. And uh, they have not been like really that low on the table though but you know we maybe was of the opinion they might get another one new win or something but you know that's just a story for another day another game we talked about was the uh, Werder Bremen versus uh, Borussia Mönchengladbach your game uh, we think Gladbach are going to win I mean they are one of the best away teams uh, in the Premier League in the in the Bundesliga <laughs> in the German Premier League in the Bundesliga so a win was pushing the Itaqua Ashoka all right, even a draw because they are in a bad place, you know, especially after the last 
uh, weekend uh, match day 27 games wametoka top 4 Hey, so that's number five. Manchester top four are Bundesliga is a lot tighter than ever. So they have to get themselves back to good ways. So much in Gladbach, we thought we were of the opinion that it's going to win that game. Then Leipzig versus Hertha Berlin. Hertha have been having a good run, but we think both Webby and I agree that that run is coming to an end tomorrow when they face Leipzig. Uh, so and actually Webby said it's going to be like a three nil win for Leipzig. I think. I think anything less than that might be a shocker. If Leipzig don't get three points out of that game, that would be a shocker. Even a draw, it's a qua, it's a qua shocker. So we thought that game is that's that's how it's gonna happen this weekend or this not this weekend. Jesus Christ, this midweek match day. All right, that's all. And I'm recording this again because the Zoom meeting I had with Webby the Mesao could record. So I just like highlighted what we talked about. That was terrible. That was terrible. Next time you see how that one, I will not forget. All right, guys. So, what do you think is going to happen in the big game? Of course, the classica, Mr. Classica. Is he going to be on top of his game tonight? Are we going to see the two goal scoring machines doing their thing, or is it going to be any different? Tell us what you think on the comment section. <laughs>